This is us trying to get our Jerusalem on, but we failed miserably. Last time you came with us to the island of Kanoan and the absolute picturesque Bekoa. But this week, sadly, we have to go to St. Vincent to say goodbye to Magda. So offshore, they fall and free. We are two crazies from South Africa. That's Frick and Pietru. We decided to chuck it all and we are now living and sailing full-time on our new home, Sisu. Oh, and another add-on to our intro is my twin sister, Magda. Pietru has started the engines. And this was... Port Elizabeth Bay and it's time for us to go to drop off Magda. We're coming up here on St. Vincent, the, the island itself and it's very pretty but it's a little bay but it is a pretty dangerous entrance and if you can, guys cannot really see but there's a lot of reefs there let me show you so you can see there's a little channel there and maybe there's another channel there but all of them is so shallow so we're just going to go in and check it out and then go maybe through here and then try to get an anchorage over there so this is the hole of St. Vincent Without a care in the world I was one rich little girl So we decided rather to grab a mooring wall in Young Island Cut as those reefs were way too challenging. It is a really cool mooring spot where you have St. Vincent on the one side and the Young Island on the other side where this beautiful resort is. And apparently this is where Johnny Depp stayed during the filming of Pirates of the Caribbean, The Black Bull. No mistake ever kept me late We spent summers catching fireflies And winters on our skates One big smile across my face We used to... So something that's just brought to my attention Sixty meters And look at those innocent smiles. <laughs> it's like, hey! Oh. Going to be hell. Okay, the view is good. Let's go down. <laughs> That's me breathing. Oh, those guys are drifting. You know, I could have sent a drone up here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we can do it. Uh, we can do it. Oh, yo, look where step picks. <laughs> Very steep, 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 eh? Yeah, this is way worse than I thought. Uh huh. <laughs> Sympathies to Frick. <laughs> Sympathies to Magda. So I went to church on Sundays. Mama set the pace. This outcrop is where Fort Duvedet is located, formerly known as Young's Sugarloaf. That never-ending staircase leads to two gun decks, and those canyons are actually originals from the reigns of George II and III. There are also some ruins on there which was probably used for accommodation for the garrison or storage. 
But anyway, built in the 1790s, Duvernet was also known as Rock Fort. It has a beautiful view when you get to the top of Calico Bay and Indian Bay. The fort was built to protect the colonial hub of Calacao, where sugar was loaded onto ships bound for the English ports. And now there's a couple of mysteries surrounding this fort. Like, why does it have a French name but British cannons? And who built the 250 sta five stairs up to the top of the fort? And then the last one, how did they get those cannons all the way to the top? I did some googling but found no definite answer. So maybe if you know anything, let us know. After the hike, it was time to cool down and we decided to practice for a thumbnail. Oh, wait, the drone moved. Okay, let's get the drone back in position. Okay, everybody all stations. Okay, come on, Frick, get over that side. Okay, now we decide. Okay, Magda, I think you go first, and then I'll count, and then Pietro will go. Okay, on my mark, let's do this. One, two, three. We're on our way to the movie set scene of Pirates of the Caribbean. And we just saw this future in a little alcove. So we need to go around the corner first, but we thought we'll just pop in and see what it looks like. Pretty neat boat. This is one of the landmarks when you come into the movie set of Pirates of the Caribbean, the Black Ball. So if you see this thing, you'll have reached the spot. As a young girl, it feels were mine. We played hide and seek for hours, raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, playful and free. Without a care in the world, I was one rich little girl. Daydreamer kidnapped me. The swells in this bay was pretty huge, and Frick wasn't very happy with the mooring ball we were on, so he just decided to stay on Sisu, and Machta and I went with Tipex. And um, unfortunately, we lost quite a bit of footage on this trip as well, so there are some pictures that we managed to save from our hard drive that we took on the scene. There is the set, but it's not maintained. There's ladders all over the place, chairs all over the place. Um, it's definitely not maintained, so it's a pity. We're at uh, Wally Bay and it's just, this is the scene for uh, a lot of the outdoor shots of Pirates of the Caribbean. There's still some of the memorabilia about from the movie. We have these, uh, what were supposed to be sacks of cotton. Uh, these old crates, boxes. Uh, there's some of the cannons that were used over here in the, uh, as backdrops in the movie. Unfortunately, in October last year, we had a, a hurricane, the surge from a hurricane, Hurricane Omar and it wrecked, uh, the big surge waves coming in wrecked a lot of the original stage setting, uh, the dock setting. Um, so it, there's not a lot left of that. No mistake ever kept me late We spent summers catching fireflies and winters on our skates One big smile across my face Used to dance our way to church on Sundays. Mama set the pace. Daydreamer, kidnapped me. Take me back, all the way back to them days. Oh, 
we need to put some plastic bags away and look for a beer. This is a very nice bar and the food a little bit pricey but it is good. This is the view. Look at that. That's Welcome to South food. Beach, man. <laughs> there. <laughs> Farser as dit kan je niet krijgen. Needless to say, those lobsters landed up on the plate. An awesome farewell dinner with Magda. As the next day, sadly, it was time to say goodbye. And then it was just the two of us. I will always, always treasure the time I got to spend with my sister on Sisu. It was super special. But it was time for us to clean up and ship up. Sisu in preparation for another dear friend that came to visit us. So stay tuned for more adventures with Adria. Were mine. We played hide and seek for hours. Raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, play full and free Without a care in the world I was one rich little girl Daydreamer, kidnap me Take me back, all the way back To them days Running around In a gown and a crown Barefoot All the food, the shade, the rum. Yes, the rum is gone. Why is the rum gone? The entire Royal Navy is out looking for me. Do you really think that there is even the slightest chance that they won't see it? But why is the rum gone? Why is the rum always gone? Meaning William Turner, Captain Sparrow. Elizabeth, why the rum? You know, these clothes do not flatter you at all. It should be a dress or nothing. It's only half a dozen kegs of powder! Then load the rum! And that was without even a single drop of rum. Oh, oh.